CBS Young and the Restless Spoilers, Ben Stitch has run away from Genoa, but fans believe she will be held accountable by the law. Victor never forgives anyone who harms his family. Victor has had some grudges with Ben for a long time. Now is his chance for revenge. Ben Stitch was once Abby's husband and son-in-law, but he's completely changed this time around. When Ben showed up in Genoa, Victor knew something bad was about to happen. He greeted Stitch warmly, and they even talked about getting together. Victor knows that he is back and wants to build a new love with Abby that applies to both his son and daughter, but perhaps especially his daughters. Among Victor's son-in-law, he is not fond of Billy especially. He always has a grudge against Adam and the Newman family, which makes the family relationship not good. Victor really couldn't stand that guy. Next was Ashlyn. He was more inter understanding and calm than anyone, but was... He thinking in his heart, we still don't know, but he probably really likes Stitch Rayburn, Abby Newman's ex-husband. That's what's not liked to about Ben, before his latest incident anyway. Ben Stitch saved many lives in Genoa while working at Memorial. He was a famous doctor. That alone made him love Victor Newman and Young and the Restless. Ben Stitch is also a good husband to Abby. But with trouble that Max caused, that action could not be forgiven and corrected. Ben had to leave Genoa unjustly. Ben Stitch knew that if he didn't run away, he would be taken to jail. The fact that he is Mariah's kidnapper is well known, and the police have issued a wanted warrant. Ben sat crying and begging Abby to forgive him. He just wanted to be the hero in front of her and win back the old love. But the plan failed. Admit the truth and bring her to the house he belongs to. Hit a replacement for her. But as soon as he got there... Ben shot up the success on y &R. Abby knows it's her fault for being so indifferent to Ben's feelings, but she doesn't really have feelings for him anymore, especially since they could have used the document to help with the birth. But he knew he would be arrested because the police couldn't be far behind him, and he was right, so the kidnapping document made it out immediately. Ray is doing his best to complete the mission this time. He doesn't want the bad guys to be outlawed, so there will be more of him. Victor is also participating in the search. He wants to find out before the police and punish Ben. After all, Ben Rayburn put the life of his nephew, Victor, in jeopardy with this plan on y &R. Ben is hiding somewhere in an abandoned house in the woods. He still can't leave Genoa to go to another city by plane. Max is really dead. What he said was just a lie. But if the boy is still alive, then Stitch might be going his way. If so, Victor can either go on his own or send some of his resources after the doctors with delusions. What will Victor do when he finds out about him? Be him, torture him, or put him in jail?